Lots of animals have a great big set of chompers on them. It's how they rip their prey to pieces and swallow them up. And there are some dastardly animals out there who really know how to tuck into their dinner. There are some animals who can unleash more damage with a single bite than we humans could unleash with an arsenal of weapons. These are the animals with the strongest bite force. Number 15. Nile Crocodiles Many people have always pondered how crocodiles managed to survive for 200 million years, outliving dinosaurs by an impressive 65 million years. Could it be their teeth? Because they aren't exactly hiding them away discreetly. While the 20-foot length and 1,650-pound weight of a Nile crocodile are impressive enough, it's their bite force that truly wows people and scares them. <laughs> At 5,000 pounds per square inch, they have far more power than tigers, lions, and pretty much anything else. In those powerful jaws are sharp, conical teeth that make escaping from the jaws of this croc nearly impossible. Of course, given that they are the second largest reptile in the world, they would overpower you with strength alone anyway. As you probably would have guessed, the Nile croc has no natural predators. Everything from fish to birds, carrion to zebras, and even antelope are at the mercy of this reptilian powerhouse with its massive jaw. Unless they happen to have duct tape, of course. For all the bite force, this croc has an incredibly weak opening muscle. Any human can easily hold a croc's mouth shut, and simple tape can be all it takes to take away their biggest weapon. Like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or Slenderman will come from under your bed while you're sleeping. <laughs> Number 14. Tigers. The tiger is not an animal you want to mess with. If it isn't its 933-pound bulk, 11.1-foot length, and pretty catty attitude that sends you running for the hills, then it will be its bite force. If you thought the lion's set of chompers were scary, then you haven't seen the look on the dentist's face as he works on a tiger. A tiger's bite force is 1,050 pounds per square inch, which is twice the bite force of the lion. With so much force, you can near guarantee they are literally chomping at the bit to sink their teeth into their dinner. There's no delicate birds and insects for these four-legged friends, no siree. They prefer animals that weigh at least 200 pounds. Still, they won't turn their nose up if a crocodile, sloth bear, leopard dog, or python is on the menu either. Given just how fierce their jaw is, it's probably of no surprise that they are an apex predator. They live alone, hunt alone, and take down their giant prey alone. Therefore, it makes sense for them to be at the top of the food chain. They fear nothing because they are the thing to fear. Number 13. Spotted Hyenas Okay, we're probably just as confused as you are. How can a spotted hyena, which is only around 140 pounds, have one of the strongest bite forces in the world? <laughs> It's easy to underestimate this furry little critter, and that's probably just the way they like it. Spotted hyenas have a bite force of around 1,100 pounds per square inch. That means it can chomp down on something harder than both lions and tigers. That bite force surely gives it some confidence too, for the hyena tends to prefer attacking prey between 123 to 401 pounds, which is not exactly lightweight. There's 
there's a common misconception that spotted hyenas are just scavengers, that they would prefer to feed on food that other animals leave behind. While they're not averse to eating what their fellow African animals don't want, they're equally as skilled at collecting their own meal, too. They get a cape buffalo, rhino, or wildebeest in their sights, and it's game on. One bite from this dog-like critter can literally crush bones but they also don't work alone. Which probably removes some of your confusion around how a tiny 140 pound animal can take down a rhino. They hunt in packs that represent the animal they are pursuing. For example, 25 hyenas for the family might go for a rhino dinner, but only 10 might tackle a zebra. Number 12, African Wild Dogs. The bite of a domestic dog, even in play, can cause you to utter a few expletives. It might even require a trip to the emergency room. But if you think a standard dog bite is painful, then you clearly haven't been bitten by an African wild dog, and you'll be pleased. While their bite force is only 142 PSI, which is hardly comparable to a tiger, it is the highest for any carnivora mammal, excluding the Tasmanian devil, which is a marsupial carnivore. The bite force is also measured relative to its mass. African wild dogs only weigh around 50 pounds or less, so that bite force is pretty incredible for the pint-sized critter. With it, they can bring down all manner of huge animals, like zebras, wildebeest, gazelles, impala, and springboks. But we'd be lying if we said they did it on their own. Like many animals, African wild dogs hunt in packs. Historically, it was found that they would hunt in groups of more than 100. Today, though, that's more like 10. And there are usually more males in a pack than females. Number 11, Polar Bears. Coca-Cola made polar bears seem so kind, fuzzy, and cuddly. And don't even get us started on Yogi Bear. But before you think about running up to a fully grown polar bear, it's worth knowing that they have the strongest jaw of all carnivorous land mammals. Do you really want to put a body part near their mouth? Polar bears are relatively similar in size to Kodiak bears and can weigh as much as 1,543 pounds or thereabouts. Out of all members of the bear family, they also eat the most meat. Their daily menu consists of ringed seals, bearded seals, and the odd scavenged whale carcass. And to get through all that meat, they need to have a pretty gnarly set of chompers, which is exactly what they've got. A polar bear has a bite force of around 1,200 pounds per square inch, which is a bit more than the likes of grizzly bears and brown bears. And while their sheer heft is enough to take out their prey, as are their spectacular claws, it's their teeth that do all the hard work. Number 10, Anacondas. There's a reason why any kind of snake often goes by the name of Nope Rope, and that's because they're just terrifying and you would rather not be around them. If it's not their looks and killer instincts that scare you, then it's undoubtedly their teeth and bite force. Anacondas are around 100 feet long, so it's not like they'll have any trouble bringing down small mammals to eat. But you might wonder how, with no legs, they manage to feast on deer, sheep, turtles, tapers, and other large mammals. It's because their teeth are unique and have a bite force of around 900 PSI. They wait in murky parts of rivers, choosing their time wisely for when an animal comes in for a drink. They will then use their teeth and powerful jaw to drag their snack under the water. If it's not their body coiled around the animal that causes it to suffocate and die, then it's the act of being held underwater until it drowns. The teeth on the anaconda are also not used for chewing, but rather for holding onto their prey to stop them from escaping. Number 9. Hippopotamuses 
Hasbro was onto something when they released the game Hungry Hungry Hippos, but when they said you'll have a chompin' good time, they probably should have said that about the hippos, not the players. For there's no competing with the incredible bite force of the hippo. <laughs> They have an incredible 1,825 pounds per square inch of chewing power, or up to 2,000 pounds per square inch, which is more than many other living mammals. If the force isn't enough to wow you, then the sheer size of their teeth will. Hippos have incisors and canines that measure 1.4 feet and 1.8 feet long. Imagine trying to close your mouth around those pearly whites. That might be why they can open their mouth to a 180 degree angle. But when you've got huge teeth, you've gotta have a huge body. And hippos do. They weigh up to around 3,986 pounds, which makes them an animal you don't want to mess with. Given how aggressive and unpredictable they are, and that they can run up to 19 miles per hour, they are one of Africa's most dangerous animals. Number 8. Lions Most of us were taught from a young age that lions are not animals you can typically walk up to and pat, especially those in the wild. But while their ripping, tearing claws were reason enough not to, so are their teeth. The bite force of a lion is six times what ours is. That's incredible. This 650-pound beast has the ability to clamp down on its dinner's throat and crush its trachea. The animal then suffocates before becoming the lion's snack. But while the lion has its deadly bite force as one of its most important features, its pure strength and claws are no laughing matter either. The lion will chase its snack of choice, be it a wildebeest, buffalo, or similar, put its neck in its mouth, and use its powerful leg muscles to pounce on it. Sometimes, when the occasion calls for it, it then shreds the animal with its claws until it looks like a pile of fluffy ribbon. Lions tend to be quite delicate, if you can believe it, with how they go about preparing dinner for their family. Still, putting that theory to the test is not something we'd like to do in a hurry. Number 7. Bull Sharks no one tends to be the biggest fan of bull sharks. They are the bullies of the ocean and are ferocious with both humans they come into contact with and their snacks of choice. But as it turns out, they're not just cranky, but powerful too. When you compare shark species like hammerheads and great whites, bull sharks have the strongest pound-for-pound -pound bite force. Of course, a 16-inch great white will be more potent than a 10-foot bull shark, but if they were the same size, the bull shark would come out on top. The University of South Florida in Tampa somehow managed to measure the bite force of 13 different shark species. We hate to think how they managed to do that, but they found that a 9-foot bull shark's bite force was 478 pounds. An 8-foot great white's bite force was just 360 pounds. Biologists think the force has something to do with the shark's head width. Their heads are broad compared to other sharks, and they've even been responsible for biting sea turtles clean in half, shell and all. Yeah, we'll be staying out of the water. Number 6. Gorillas We are pleased to announce that one of the largest primates with one of the most powerful bite forces isn't out to get us. Phew. Sure, gorillas are intimidating in many ways. They stand at around 5.6 feet tall, and they weigh up to 352 pounds. And they also have long, sharp canine teeth with an incredible bite force of 1,300 pounds per square inch. But they're not about to eat you for lunch with them, and for that, we're thankful. <laughs> 
gorillas are quite gentle and will only use their long canine teeth to scare off threats. Their real purpose is for feeding on roots and bark, which can take a bit of chewing. They also eat lots of fibrous food, and standard teeth just wouldn't do. Imagine trying to eat shoes, tubers, barks, and nuts with your everyday ordinary human teeth. He'd be in a million pieces. Believe it or not, this herbivore doesn't just get its strength from its teeth and jaw, but from its neck, too. All those muscles play a part in giving this animal one of the most powerful bite forces in the animal kingdom. Number 5. Jaguars Dependent on what you read, jaguars supposedly have a bite force of between 1,500 and 2,000 pounds per square inch. To whoever's getting bitten, that 500 PSI discrepancy is bound not to make much of a difference. Any bite of any force is gonna be utterly excruciating. Jaguars are the largest cats in the Americas, so we're not all that surprised that they have a wicked bite force. According to some sources, it is nearly twice as much as the tiger. But given their diet of caiman, turtles, and similar large animals, we understand why. They need to be able to penetrate through thick layers like turtle shells. They couldn't do that with marshmallows for teeth. Unlike other cats that tend to bite through an animal's throat to disable them, a jaguar aims for its skull. Its jaw widens far enough to penetrate the head and cause near-immediate death. Some animals hunt in packs to bring down large prey, but jaguars are solitary kitty cats. They hunt alone, live alone, and don't need any other animal to keep them company. Number 4. Great White Sharks The Great White Shark has a powerful bite force of 4,000 pounds per square inch. Still, we can't help but feel a little bit let down. After all, Jaws the movie gave us the impression that Great White Sharks were this unbeatable force, when in fact they aren't as impressive as crocodiles or even bull sharks on a pound-by-pound -pound basis. Steve Rowe and a team of Australian scientists back in 2008 used computer modeling on shark skull x-rays to estimate the bite force of a great white. We'd like to hear their reasoning for not trying it on a live one. They worked out that the bite force depends on the size of the shark. So a great white between 11 and 15 feet in length would not have as great a bite force as, say, a crocodile of the same size. Scientists believe that their bite force, while impressive, is not as great as it could be because they don't need it to be. Sharks slice through their prey and also shake their heads to rip off flesh. They don't need the force to cause considerable damage. If you find yourself face to face with a very mad grizzly bear, then you'll need to think twice about using a skillet or bowling ball as a form of protection. With a bite force exceeding 1,200 PSI, they'll break through it like they were chewing marshmallows. <laughs> Grizzly bears have an impressive set of chompers, and all thanks to their powerful jaw. They also have 800 pounds of pure muscle behind them, not to mention a 7-foot height to help them overpower their opponent. In all senses of the word, they are a symbol of strength. So, you know, don't get on the wrong side of them. They can be quite aggressive, even if human attacks are rare. And their claws are equally as powerful as their bite. So much so that in some stories, they supposedly can decapitate a moose with one swipe of their paws. Their jaws are also that powerful that they can bite through trees, bones, bowling balls, and a cast iron skillet. This subspecies of the brown bear in North America is not one you want to get on the wrong side of. Number 2. Alligator Snapping Turtle Swimming in natural bodies of water like the ocean or rivers always brings about a sense of nervousness. Unlike swimming pools, there's a lot that can be lurking underneath. 
like alligator snapping turtles, for example. And if you happen to come across these little guys while out swimming, then it might be the last time you ever set foot in the water again, if you even have a foot left. <laughs> Fortunately, alligator snapping turtles, not to be confused with the common snapping turtle, are quite rare. For that, we're thankful. They might be small, but they have a bite force of around 1,000 pounds per square inch. That's enough to take off a toe or two. Even more terrifying is knowing that they live for around 100 years. So while they might take off your toes, they could also be around to bite off those of your grandchildren too. Fortunately, most alligator snapping turtles tend to not be aggressive unless threatened. So you're likely to be quite safe swimming in the water with them. Still, why would you want to take the risk? I'll stick to the paddling pool. Number 1. Crocodile Okay, so imagine you've got an animal that weighs a ton, measures in in more than 20 feet long, and has managed to live for around a squillion years. Okay, 200 million. There has to be a reason why it's still here. We're gonna take a stab in the dark and say it might have something to do with bite force. Crocodiles, which are an alligator's close cousin, have a bite force of around 3,700 pounds per square inch. Uh, pardon me? That's right. Nearly nothing is a match for the crocodile once it has you firmly in its grasp, literally. They have large, powerful jaw muscles, which means that if you end up in the mouth of a croc, there's very little chance you'll be coming out of it. We thought croc shoes were scary enough, but they've got nothing on the real croc. Fortunately, if it offers any relief, crocodiles are quite lazy animals. They can survive for a long time without food, but then they've worked up such an appetite that they can literally eat a horse. They devour water buffalo, sharks, cows, and humans. The only advice we can offer is that you stay away from any bodies of water that you'd be potentially sharing with a hungry croc. So there you have it, folks. Here are 15 animals to write on your run away from very quickly list, for you don't want to feel the full force of their pearly whites. Have you ever been bitten by an animal? If so, what was it? Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time.